Full Skews just changed the game again. Believe it or not, even with all the big innovations that we've just made with MCP and ONNX nodes, we have yet another awesome feature that we've just released. It's called the Flow Fuse Expert Assistant, and it's a fantastic way to get started with your project in seconds. Hey there, my name is Christopher Sandoval. I'm a developer relations advocate here at Flowfuse, and I'm so excited to show you this new feature today. So getting started with Flowfuse Expert Assistant is incredibly easy. When you're on the main page, simply go to this box and ask it a question. We'll ask it something simple like, how do I connect to an MQTT endpoint? As you can see, Flowfuse Expert Assistant is now coming through all of the documentation and it's putting together a great recipe for us to follow. And here we are, we have a quick recipe to follow to put together an MQTT flow. Let's do something a little bit more complicated. So let's say I have something like this. I have two temperature sensors that are being brought into Flowfuse, and they're just reporting their numbers into two debug nodes. Super simple, not really complex. What I can do is ask the expert assistant, how would I go about building a comparative dashboard? Now, once I've submitted my question, we'll give the expert assistant a few seconds to think. And there we go, it's generated a guide just for this problem. Great, so the first step is to prepare sensor data. And I've already got it in a data form that I like, but it looks like I need to do a little bit more transformation. Great, so that's the first step done. Let's see what's next. Okay, so the second step says that I need to use a chart node. So I'll go over to filter nodes and I'll search for chart. Huh, there's no chart node. That must mean that I don't have the package installed. So I'll go over to manage palette. I'll click the install button and I'll type in flowfuse forward slash node red dashboard. And here we are, I'll click install and I'll wait for the package to fully install. So now when I search for chart, there's what I'm looking for. So I'll drag that onto my workspace and I'll move on to the next step. So step three says to connect the outputs of the change nodes with each unique message topic to the input of the chart node. All right, so I'll connect from this first change node and then from the second one and I'll deploy. Okay, so in the next step, it says that we have to configure the dashboard node. So I'll go to the chart node and great, it looks like it's already configured. Now let's look at our dashboard. And just like that, we've created a simple chart that lets us see the relationship between the values we're getting from sensor one and the values we're getting from sensor two. The Flowfuse Expert Assistant was so easy to use that we were able to get this S7-1200 connected to this Geo stack light in seconds. And here we are, our lights are connected and we're able to control them through Flowfuse. So as you can see, Flowfuse Expert Assistant really lowers the barrier of entry for people who are new to Node-RED, but it also speeds up the workflow for experienced developers. And that's especially true because shortly, we're going to ship a version of this that lives inside of the application, and that will deliver a ton of benefit to make sure that your workflows and your processes are as efficient as they can be. As you can see, this is a huge deal. Flowfuse was already getting people going in minutes, and now you can get going in seconds. And the best part of it is, is that we released it so that anybody can come in and use it and see how they might build their next dream application inside of Flowfuse. If you're not on Flowfuse already, you can head to flowfuse.com and sign up for a free 14-day trial. I hope you've enjoyed this feature. If you did, please give us a like, comment, or subscribe, and let us know in the comments below what new features you'd love to see built out on Flowfuse. This has been Christopher Sandoval, and I'll see you in the next one.